17-year-old Tate Moreland is an honor student and varsity athlete at Ashgrove High School. He plays basketball, football, and golf, and has done community work, like starting a grocery shopping and delivery service for his senior citizen neighbors. But in June of 2016, after a preseason basketball practice, Tate came down with a severe headache and fever. There's been several occasions in my life where I'm like, oh, that's the worst pain I've ever been in. But going through that, it was just a whole nother world because, I mean, my head was just level 10 pain every day. It turned out that Tate had bacterial meningitis from a pocket of infection between his skull and brain caused by a sinus infection that went backwards instead of draining forwards. Tate had to be taken by ambulance to the airport and flown to a children's hospital in St. Louis. The chances of there being mental deficits as a result um, and it being life-threatening, um, those chances were very real. I was very scared, yes. Tate spent a week in St. Louis where he had surgery, and during that time he lost a lot of weight, going from 145 down to 118. He would have a long, grueling road ahead to return to athletics. Having to live through that is just, I don't even know how I did it, honestly, but I just remember looking back and thinking, I mean, this can't be the end. I, I still got two years of high school left. I want to play basketball. I want to hang out with my friends. Those friends rallied to show their support during this critical time. His church had prayer services, and the girls' basketball team wore T-shirts in his honor. She was just really inspiring, and that made me feel really good. And then, of course, all my basketball buddies and football buddies, they were texting me saying, keep your head up, you're going to get through it. With his family and friends' encouragement, Tate returned to the court last fall and is now fully healthy. He's appreciative of his second chance in life and the financial support that CMN Hospitals provided in helping pay the mountain of medical bills. For instance, the airplane ride alone was a $90,000 bill. So just knowing that they, uh, they were able to help us, it just meant a lot, and I know it meant a lot to my parents. The debt is overwhelming, but that's not what matters because I have a healthy son. And there's a lot of people that don't have that. There's a lot of people who Children's Miracle Network can help them, and, and their child is, is still ill. My child came out on the other side healthy, and I'm forever grateful to God for that. I'm grateful to Children's Miracle Network for helping us with the debt. It just means the world.